Hi everybody, Quint Lears, newhomesales.com. I'm with the Community Spirit Award winners. Tell me the name of your company. Royal Oaks Homes. This is Rich Van Tassel, Zach. Woody. Rich Sherman. Rich Sherman. They gave back, and what's special about the Community uh, Spirit Award is that you're not just giving back to anybody, you give back to some very special people. Tell me about that. Well, we look for uh, people with North Carolina ties that are combat wounded in the current Iraqi and Afghanistan campaigns. Dang it. I'm, I was at the Air Force. I was hoping I qualified. But tell me, you did something big. It's not something, you know, a lot of these people give away fruit baskets and stuff. Tell me about what you actually did uh, for a, a wounded veteran with North Carolina ties from where you're from. Well, what, what we did was... The whole team did. Yeah, what we did, along with our trade partners, it's real important to note that, that we couldn't have done it without them. Uh, we gave a house, a worthy veteran, and, and, and their family, and their family. Tell me about the veteran, not without names, but do you have a little bit of history of that, of that gentleman or, or, or woman or in that veteran? Yeah, yeah, I'm happy to tell you about it, I, and I'd love to tell you his name. His name is Sergeant, uh, Sergeant Brandon Temple. He's a yeah. platoon leader for the second, and I, I get, sometimes I get this wrong, second Force Marine Recon, and if I got that wrong, I apologize. What's his name? His name is Brandon Temple. Brandon, thank you for your service from NewHomesales.com. So he served uh, for 10 years in the Marines and uh, did two tours in Iraq and one tour in Afghanistan. And uh, in his last tour, he got he got caught by an IED. And, um, you know, he's, he's, he's on the road to recovery. He, he's great and, you know, um, don't want to single him out too much because he's the 16th guy that got a home from us. Um, they're all working themselves back into recovery. I appreciate what you're doing, um, you know, in the home building industry. You're giving back. Um, you, you know, people need help. And I know this doesn't heal the wounds of war, even a house or a car. Um, but it shows it's, 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 it's a demonstration that you care. Why was it important uh, specifically for the veterans in, in, in creating this award? Well, I, I think it's important for a couple reasons number one it's a community award and um, I, I, I want to really emphasize this point the it's a community award and it's a community effort and uh, aptly named community award for the community effort we've got electricians framers HVAC people painters landscapers trade professionals all of them that come out and donate in kind and so they line up what do we got? We got a combat veteran. We need to help them out. They're like, how can I help? And so generally we have two at each slot uh, to come out and, um, you know, to give the house. That's a man. You oversaw the project, Zach, didn't you? I have. Um, this is this will be my seventh one now, or sixth one now. So I'm, I'm very excited. Thanks for being a great example to the other builders and, um, you know, any last words or anything for our veterans? Who does this broadcast to? Home builders, salespeople, marketing people, regular people. Well, it's the same challenge that I issued uh, up on the podium. Um, we only do this for, we, we, we don't need uh, self-congratulatory, you know, we, we don't need it. We, we're, I mean, it's nice to hear, but the reason we do interviews like this is to try to promote what is possible and um, as I said up there, do one. Just do one. Just do one. Okay, so new home sales. You'll never not do another one. You'll never not do another one. Do one. I want somebody watching this to do one of these homes for the veterans. That would love. Do one. Do something. Do something. Do something. USA, baby. Do hey, what you can do. What you can do. Guys, thanks. Thanks for um, taking care of our veterans. You. You, you've been it's an honor and a privilege. My pleasure, man. Be good, man.